It is the end of another era in the world of fashion. Henry Bendel, best known for its upscale purses and shoes, will shut down its stores and its website after the holidays, after 123 years in business. Fans all along Fifth Avenue reacting to this unexpected announcement. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Einiger has more. For generations, it's been part of the soundtrack of Fifth Avenue. Over 123 years, everyone who was anyone shopped at Bendel's. Juliet Metzger came with her mom, and her mom before her. We shopped at Bendel's my whole life, and it's so iconic New York. It's just a classic place and a classic brand. Henry Bendel was a ladies' hat maker from Louisiana who moved to New York in 1895 and opened up shop. The Y in Henry became an I in Henri and a fashion icon was born. My mom and my grandparents grew up up here in the New York, New Jersey area, so I think it's just um, probably kind of been a shopping staple for, for years. But these days, retailers are singing a different tune. To be the place where your, your parents or your grandparents shop, that's just not going to cut it, unfortunately. Dan Geiger covers retail for Cranes and says Bendel's has fallen victim to a double whammy. First, new shopping patterns thanks to the likes of Amazon, coupled with the most expensive real estate in the country. Just look around and you'll see Bendel's is far from the only store to meet the same depressing fate. And if you're not selling a lot of stuff and if you're not doing well, it's simple. You're going out of business. I mean, this, this is the shopping corridor everybody was going to. And I'm not putting this lightly. It has been a bloodbath on Fifth Avenue. I'm going to buy a lot of gifts there for people. So, you know, for the holidays. Probably can't return them, though. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, well. Bendel's parent company is trying to convince its employees to stay with the company through the holidays by dangling the prospect of working at other businesses it owns, like Victoria's Secret. But come January 2019, this store and 23 others across the country will be closed for good.